I was born a Carlton supporter. Um, well, our family's very navy, and um, regardless that I would have had no choice about who I was going to vote for, I was very lucky to be born in an era of fantastic instant success for me. So within my first five years, we had won three premierships, so there was no doubt who I was going to vote for, and, and that legacy lives on because my kids, um, whether this sounds crude or not, I'm sorry, came out of the womb singing the song. <laughs> and um, uh, the, we are a very much a Carlton family. And the fantastic part about football to me was that it gave me a, a lovely bond with my father because it was the time of the week where it was just my dad and I and would come and sit in the Healy stand and watch um, the game and would get here early and watch the twos and talk about the game afterwards and, and it was special with my old man. My most vivid memories of that day start in the morning. I, I remember waking up and being too nervous to eat breakfast. And we had some friends down from Cairns that came, big Carl supporters that came to watch the game. And we met up in the morning and everyone spoke matchups, etc. And we walked um, through Fitzroy Gardens to be able to get to the MCG. And then we all split up because we had sort of different seats. And I sat with a very close friend and oh, I remember, I guess, this nervousness and it was more of an anxiety because of probably the couple of years before in final series. But I also remember being supremely confident because of the fantastic year that we had had. And I think after kicking the first four goals of the game, I think that I was able to relax and enjoy it a little bit and, and I did. I think Greg Williams' goal when he sort of picked it up, and then I think he kicked the left foot in the in the sort of in the pocket, and then ran back and sort of oh no, I think it was pulled to ground, and then he 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 hit somebody's hand off, and then went in high five six. I believe that was my favourite moment, but I don't know. I think El Spalding's smother in the second quarter, the first goal in the second quarter, I think was was fantastic. I think the I think he also handballed it to Harry Madden and Harry came in and kicked the goal and that's where I was sitting. I was sitting in the Ponsford stand and that ball flew basically over my head so I, I remember that quite vividly. But there's a few. After the um, siren and watching uh, the lap of honour, um, I met up with my dad and a few other friends outside the front of the Hilton and someone had bought a six pack of beer and we all had a bit of a share and my brother was only 10 or 11 years old and but he had his first beer. And we walked, we called it the Premiership Walk and we walked through back through Fitzroy Gardens and walked all the way back into Carlton and then realised that we were going to be late for the function. So quickly got home, put our suits on and went to the official function for afterwards which um, oh, was just one of the best nights that, that I can remember that I've ever had. Carlton means everything to me. Carlton. <clears throat> I live in Carlton, I was born in Carlton, my parents were both born in Carlton, they had businesses in Carlton, I have business in Carlton, all my family lives in Carlton. We, we are as Carlton as you can get. Um, the football club represents the suburb and we are involved in the suburb and as the football club as much as we can be. Um, and everyone that wears that jumper, I've, I've loved.